Hi, Miss Bethany here with our behavior basic rules for this week. We're going to have our story and then we'll have discussion questions at the end. Today we're talking about fire drills. Sometimes at school, we practice how to act in case there is a fire at school. Sometimes I know when we are going to practice a fire drill. Sometimes I am surprised when it is time to practice. So sometimes we know when there's a fire drill and sometimes it's a surprise. We don't know when it's going to happen. First, an alarm will sound and a light will flash if I am inside. If it is too loud, I can cover my ears. You can cover your ears if it gets too loud. I need to stop what I am doing so that I can listen for my teacher's directions. As a class, we will line up at the door quietly, quietly line up at the door in a straight line. We will walk in a line outside and follow our teacher to our waiting spot. Every class has a different waiting spot. There is absolutely no talking during a fire drill. I will stay calm and quiet. I will wait outside until I hear instructions from my teacher. So you can sit with all of your class or you might stand, but you'll wait for your teacher to tell you what to do. It is important to stay with my teacher at all times because they need to make sure everyone is together. So a fire drill is like preparing for an emergency and you wanna make sure everyone stays safe so you stay together and listen to the teacher. If my clothes were to catch on fire, I would stop what I am doing, drop on the floor, and roll. So if part of your clothes catch on fire, and there's fire there, then stop, fall on the ground, and roll on the ground, and that will get the fire out. Fire drills keep us safe so we know what to do if there is a real fire. Okay, let's ask our discussion questions. Can you give me a thumbs up for yes to my question and a thumbs down for no to my question? You ready? Have you ever practiced a fire drill at school? Have you practiced a fire drill? If you've been in school for a whole year, you probably have practiced a fire drill, yes. Is the alarm silent? No, the alarm is loud. Should you scream when you hear a fire alarm sound? Should you scream? Ah! No, we stay calm and we should be quiet and listen to our teacher. Should you stop what you are doing when the fire alarm sounds? Yes. Even if you're doing schoolwork, stop and follow the teacher's instructions. Can you talk during a fire drill? No. During fire drills, we don't talk. We have to listen to the teacher and follow the directions. When the fire drill alarm sounds, should you run outside on your own? No, you should wait for the teacher to tell you what to do. Will your teacher give you directions during a fire drill? Yes, she'll tell you what to do and when to do it. If you or your clothes were to catch on fire, should you stop, drop, and roll? Yes, that's the best way to put a fire out. 
Do you line up in single file? Yes. Single file means one person at a time. You line up behind one person and one person lines up behind you. Will there be lights flashing during a fire drill? Yes, we can see a light flashing um, in our classroom during a fire drill or in the hallway. Okay, so now you know what to do next time you're in a fire drill. Thanks for listening.